Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to do a tax jar tutorial for beginners. In this video we will talk about tax jar, its features, how to create an account, the profile setup process and we will also do a walkthrough of the interface and show you how to integrate tax jar with your e-commerce store to download your transactional data. So watch this video till the end to better understand all these steps. Tax jar is reimagining how businesses manage sales tax compliance. Their cloud-based platform automates the entire sales tax lifecycle across all your sales channels, from calculations and nexus tracking to reporting and filing. With innovative technology and award-winning support, Tax Jar simplifies sales tax compliance so you can grow with ease. Tax Jar has been trusted by over 20,000 high growth businesses like Wild Alaskan Company, Curology, Land Rover, Big Cattle, Eventbrite, She In, and Uncommon Goods. With the help of Tax Jar, you can reduce your risk of errors and missed deadlines. Sell across more channels with less effort, integrate tax jar with your e-commerce or ERP platform, get support when you need it the most. You can use tax jar in just three steps. First is calculate. Instantly calculate accurate sales tax at checkout even during peak demand using up-to-date rates and address validation. Second is report. Get detailed, up-to-date reports on sales and sales tax collected or due by state and jurisdiction, all at your fingertips. And lastly is file and remit. Save time and reduce errors by automatically submitting returns and remittance to each jurisdiction. Never miss a deadline again. If you hover your cursor on the product tab at the top navigation bar, you can see that tax jar has products for sales tax compliance platform, real-time calculations, sales tax reports, nexus insights, filing and remittance, and integrations. And if you hover your cursor over the solutions tab, you will see that tax jar provides solutions for retail, food and beverage, medical, SaaS, services, mid-market business, and small business. Now to use TaxJar for all your needs, you need an account on it. If you already have an account, then just use this login button on the top right corner or else click on this try for free button to create an account. This is the sign up page. From here you can start your 30 day free trial and here you will see what's included in your free trial. Here enter your first name, then here enter your last name. Next, enter your business's name, then enter your business email address, create a password here. And once you have filled all these required fields, then click on the start free trial button. Now you need to set up your tax jar account in four steps. This is the first step. Here you need to confirm your business's name. Next, you will be asked on average, how many orders does your business process each month? You can select your response from the drop-down. And lastly, you will be asked to enter your phone number, but this is optional. And then finally, click on the continue button. This is the second step in which you will be asked, where is your primary business address? This address will be used to configure your account's tax settings. So enter all the details here correctly. First, select your country from this drop-down. Then here, enter your street address. Here, enter your city's name. Then select the state from the drop-down. And lastly, here enter the zip code. And once you have filled all these details, then finally click on the continue button. This is the third step in which you will be asked, how can we help you with tax compliance? If you want to calculate rooftop accurate tax rates at checkout in real time, then select the tax calculations option. If you want to access detailed tax reports and receive insights on your compliance, then select the reporting and monitoring option. 
and if you want to automate tax filings and payments with auto file then select the filing option you can select any of these or select all the three options and then click on the continue button this is the fourth and the final step in which you will be asked who will be joining you on tax jar once added tax jar will send them an invitation via email to create their account you can invite your colleagues friends or even your accountant if you don't want to add anyone then use this skip for now button in case you do want to add someone then here enter their email address from here select their role you can select between member and admin to add more use this add another button and then finally click on the continue button your account will be created and you will also see a confirmation like congrats your tax jar account is now ready now click on the view my dashboard button so this is your dashboard let's do a walk through of the interface on the top navigation bar you will see tabs for dashboard transactions auto file exemptions and filing history on the top right side you will see the account button click on it and from here you can access business profile users and roles plans and billing notifications account security state settings linked accounts tax jar api auto file and lastly logout click on business profile on this page you can view and edit your business profile details like email name business name federal tax id shipping address and billing address in the left sidebar under the account settings section you will see tabs for business profile support users and roles plan and billing state nexus settings notification preferences and account security Below is the data sources section where there are tabs for linked accounts and tax jar api and lastly is the auto file section which has only one tab that is auto file enrollments now to go back to your dashboard click on dashboard on the top left side to get started with tax jar you need to import your transaction data Tax jar can import up to 60 days of data during your trial. Once imported, you will have full access to reports and filing. If you have already downloaded your transactional data, then use this import CSV button to upload it. You can also give access of your e-commerce profile to tax jar and it will automatically import all your transactional data. To do so, click on the connect integration button. On this page you will see all the supported e-commerce platforms that you can easily integrate with TaxJar. You can integrate Amazon, Shopify, Magento, eBay, Etsy, PayPal, BigCommerce, Square, WooCommerce, Stripe, EasyWid, Walmart, Squarespace, QuickBooks, NetSuite and lastly Commerce Cloud. If you're using the free trial plan then you can integrate up to 10 platforms but if you are in the pro membership plan you can connect all these given platforms now let's integrate a shopify store click on the shopify button and on the next page here enter your shopify subdomain and then click on the save and continue button Now you will be redirected to the Shopify login page to confirm the request for access before tax jar can download your transactions. Enter your Shopify login credentials and after successfully logging in and authorizing tax jar you will be redirected back to your tax jar dashboard. With this we have completed our tax jar tutorial for beginners. This brings this video to an end. We truly hope you benefited from it. If you have any suggestions or want us to make a video on any specific topic, feel free to comment below. We will see you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed to our channel.